welcome we pointed subject of consideration during yesterday's session has been as to how we shall have a revision of our preparations the subject and aspect of a revision in a way presumes that we have already been through our preparations have been complete this as such will naturally expect that we shall have some proper designed method of approaching the whole preparations for their evaluation and supplementing steps as far as the evaluation is concerned the same can be indexed from the dictionary we have prepared the referencer we have prepared our dictionary and our referencer is the only guide for having appreciation of our efforts of our steps and the merit of the preparations themselves therefore from the point of view of having evaluation of our preparations we shall visit our dictionary and reference are both the glimpse of the different entries of our dictionary and visit to our reference notes of our referencer will give us realistic view as to how far we have been successful in our preparations as far as the revision aspect is concerned for it the experience tells us that revision shall have an degree of freedom of fresh visit to the course a fresh visit need naturally will expect there is some classification of the topics and it is this classified arrangement of the topics the goods which will facilitate in having a quick revision the quick revision also expects that if there has been some previous summary of the values of each aspect with us then being through them is going to be a very refreshing and very blissful exercise all of us may or may not be having is proper summary of the values of the subjects prepared therefore such preparation of the summaries be taken as the first revision stage those of us who are at first revision stage 
for them the natural course is that they shall take the exercise as statute wise exercise and each of the 20 statutes shall be organized subject wise the subject wise classification of the statutes provisions shall be governed by the questions asked in previous years examinations we shall have 10 years question papers these 10 years questions papers be availed firstly for the purpose of selecting the subjects from particular statute this examination point of view of stress upon the subjects is the most natural stress from our point of view therefore at the stage of first revision one shall attempt summary of each aspect it in itself is a very serious exercise and it is also a time consuming one however the time devoted for this exercise is going to be of great facility at the time of final revision of the subject the summary of each aspect shall at the outset is to have a focus upon the provisions of the statute the focus upon the provisions of the statutes shall follow by the basic authorities in respect of these provisions have a choice of the authorities in itself is a very challenging assignment however the textbooks are the best guides as the textbooks cover only the academic value based authorities these textbook authorities shall be supplemented by the latest authorities of the supreme court and punjab and haryana high court once we will be having proper focus upon the authority in reference to the provisions of the statute then it will become a very normal assignment as it simply amounts to having a tabulation of such information and data this information based summary of the provisions of the statutes will facilitate while during examination 
we will be having a finger at the proper provision of the statute which will be provided to us to spot the specific relevant provision from the statute in itself is an index of the preparations our familiarity with the provisions is an index of our preparations at the final revision naturally we have simply be simply to be through our own summary and then we may have some additions here and there in the light of subsequent information coming to our knowledge to have the glimpse as to how the topics may be spotted focused and reached at today i am pointing out as that the constitution of india article 21 regarding protection of life and liberty together with chapter 5 and chapter 33 of the code of criminal procedure regarding arrest of persons and bills provisions may be taken as one statutory topic this statutory topic in itself as it is to be firstly be taken as a set of provisions article 21 of the constitution of india and articles 41 to article 60 and article 236 436 450 of the code of criminal procedure become the text these textual provisions at the center the rest all is to be followed only in reference to these provisions one shall be well acquainted with the placement of these provisions as well as the internal sequential organization of the statutory values once we are fully acquainted with these provisions as these are and also once we have proper comprehension and insight about the internal relationship of different provisions then certainly the question to be attempted will bring to instant reference of these provisions the instant reference of these provisions will facilitate about the basic 
nature of the question being asked and being attempted. All of us who have been through the revision summary prior to entering the examination hall will have no difficulty at all to express oneself. The expression with the availability of the text of the provisions is going to be very smooth and very natural. One having an eye upon the text of these provisions will have no chance of deviation. Once the technical terminology of the text is in currency, the deviation gets minimized. The words as or having their own grammar and their own dictionary meanings as such choice of the synonyms as well at times result into a deviation from the main stream of value. Therefore, as far as possible, we shall take shelter of the vocabulary of the text itself. Once we will be insisting upon the vocabulary of the text as well as the qualitative words finding mention in the judgments, then the chances of misinterpretation or lack of communication gaps will be ensured to ensure that your answer in terms of your vocabulary has smooth communication with the evaluator of your answer sheet. The purpose of expression is that one conveys oneself and once this communication has a natural flow and a reach with the evaluator, then the fruit is bound to be blissful. As such, be through these provisions of Article 21 and the provisions of Chapter 5 and Chapter 33 and then have a visit to, a, to your summary to your dictionary, to your referencer, and have a pause. And during this pause, permit your mind to have its further satisfaction. It is this 
satisfaction which is be is going to be your own test of your own evaluation of your preparations continue this exercise like this with all the topics thank you very much